Welcome back to Electric Playground. Swing bada 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 swing bada. It's uh, never a better time of year to celebrate baseball than beautiful fall like this. And uh, congratulations to the uh, Toronto Blue Jays. They're having an incredible year. Yes, Canada's team, go Blue Jays. We are going to celebrate our favorite baseball games of all time. Marissa, Scott, and myself. I'm going to start. I think we have to give a special shout out to Sega and their legacy in baseball, starting with the World Series games on Genesis. But the big move into 3D on the Sega Saturn with World Series 98 was remarkable. I remember reviewing that game with Tommy back in the day, and my mind was completely blown because the animations looked so incredibly realistic and lifelike, and you just got a sense of depth and perspective and lots of flashy, hand-drawn, but still artistically rendered beautiful 3D animations. They didn't have replays. You couldn't trade your players, but the core fundamentals of playing baseball, one of the first games to really exemplify that. I'll always have a soft spot in my heart for the World Series games, which were, of course, the predecessor to the uh, the 2K games later on. But World Series, yeah, fond, fond memories. Over to you, Scott. Thanks, Vic. Oh, wow. High heat on that one, buddy. Listen, my favorite baseball game of all time has to be the big series, the bigs one and the bigs two. Ben Silverman and I, you know, we're baseball game aficionados, and we both agree that this is some of the most exciting, most thrilling baseball game anywhere ever in the history of video games. The thing that I always love about sports games, and I feel like Madden gets this wrong, and the NBA series both get this wrong, is they're a little bit too literal. They ask gamers to learn too much about the real sport forget the real sport let's have something crazy let's have something over the top and the big series did this better than anyone ever has before it's kind of like a combination of pinball and baseball the game was made right here in vancouver british columbia i love this game but you know what let's check in with our reliever marissa roberto marissa thanks boys a nice throw there scott listen i've got the best video game that contains baseball ever made. It is MVP 2005. Yes, I'm talking about the one with Manny Ramirez on the cover. This one just brought me so much joy on my Xbox for so many reasons, mostly because of the mini games involving pitching and hitting. There's never been anything like it in a video game since really in a baseball video game. I really missed those times. It really brought me into a baseball video game in general. That was my first one that I ever really dove into, pun intended. Even though it has Manny being Manny on the cover, it's okay, it didn't deter me. Of course, wearing that Boston Red Sox batting hat. Oh my goodness. All these things that pull me away from the game. It doesn't matter. Honestly, there's so much fun to be have in a mini game. I feel like so many sports games don't have this stuff anymore and I think it's something to hold on to. If you have it, please go back and play it. If not, you can go to the PC and pick it up because people are modding this thing. Also, it's just a great time to pick up a baseball game in general because yes, it is October baseball. Oh my God, I love the Blue Jays. I love baseball so much. I can't help it. I'm going to run the bases right now. Run! Hey! 